Hello guys and welcome to a new video. So if you watched the previous video, we spoke about this grinder. This was like a quick unboxing video about it. And I also tried some grind settings with it. It's called POTO and it has a 49 uh, millimeters uh, flat burr, which is different from the normal that we used to, uh, like having uh, easy press grinders and Commandante and all these uh, conical grinders. This has a flat burr uh, inside. The flat bird that works for espresso and also filter so as per the manual this is a chinese made grinder just like the easy presso and the other grinders that we have um, it has a very good build quality like very very nice feel in the hand and the grinding with it is very simple uh, that was the manual that came with it it stated that every number has like three clicks between the number and the next one every click has around you can say uh, 18 microns, yeah, they mentioned 18 microns, and it has a total of one and a half rotations, if I'm not mistaken. So the rotation has 24 numbers, okay, and then it goes up to I think number 16 or 17 in the next rotation. So you could say this has around maybe 70 to 80 clips in total, maybe 90, and. Uh, the hopper can take up to 30 grams of coffee and in this video I'm just going to try to open it with you and see how the burr looks so to do that I will just put the handle first and take out the cup and then I will try to take this thing out Yeah, exactly. That's how it comes out. Okay, and then we get to see the burr chamber. That's the burr. It's a titanium coated burr, 49 millimeters burr. Let's have a closer look on it. It's very simple to take it out, and I think to put it back. I'm not sure of the alignment of it. We can check that together another video maybe and I can just give it a quick clean now so as you watched in the previous video it comes with this lower this these two brushes like a makeup brush and also this other black brush and also comes with uh, some straps if you want to change the color of these straps and a nice carry pouch That's how the burr looks. So there are other um, makers or other versions of this grinder that come with two different types of burr sets. This one and the other one is a ghost uh, teeth burr. That's how the burr looks. And that's the other one. So to put that together again, we have to put this one like that. Yeah. Okay, press them together and then we add this one just like that. Yes, and then we then go with this one and then we keep closing it until the burrs are completely closed. This has to go well first, I think this is not well placed. Press it at this one. Start the closure. Yeah. 
you have placed it wrong. I just like to do that with you so that I don't edit the video and cut <laughs> these parts to give you the true experience and how real life things go. Hmm. So there's a spring inside. And this dot should be placed on that one. I don't see well because of the flash. That's my problem now. But actually I can just put it just like that. And then I can tweak the handle from the bottom. Yes, that's how it is. And then we start putting the... Not. Yeah. That's how it is. Okay. Exactly the same all the closure position the arrow points at number P49 so this is how I closed it and then you put the cup this cup is a bit bigger than the, the one comes with the easy press ok plus and this is how I cleaned the grinder and I'll see you in next videos when I try to do um, some coffee and make some coffee with it Thank you.